वेलकम बैक आई थिंक प्रीवियस सेगमेंट इन दिया ना वाज टॉकिंग अबाउट डूइंग कोड कटिंग सो हाउ डू यू गेट योर कंटेंट डिलीवर्ड तेलीना uh now calling it, there are a lot of uh, streaming services right yeah. uh netflix amazon prime hulu uh some of them are available in sri lanka but not all so a lot of people get confused i mean even during the break uh, a lot of people ask what is it i know it so for example netflix what it is so netflix is a uh, so to watch netflix you either need a computer a phone or a smart tv or an apple tv some kind of device so what it does is it uses the internet to co- deliver your content on demand when i say on demand one thing i hate watching uh, i don't like watching tv is you see a lot of advertisements i mean i mean you can't blame them you you give you get the channel for free right yeah. so you get the channel for free so how they make their money obviously business need to survive they run advertisements uh, but companies like netflix amazon how they make their money is uh, they charge you for it yeah. uh, it's calling the same as paying your phone bill right you yes. you pay some amount end of the month yeah so, so before before netflix the is about $9 yeah. so it's about 1100 but uh, sadly in sri lanka for you to watch any of those internet delivery tvs including youtube you need to pay for the internet connection yeah and you need to have a good internet connection to watch these things and uh, again uh, the bandwidth so if you watch a netflix movie in hd uh, it will use about 2 to 3 gbps of data uh, here data is really expensive so that's one of the downfalls about this as well but compared to local channels if you are watching local tv if we have a lcd ldd tv if, if it's hd tv the quality is really different i mean like the con- i mean if you have a really good connection that it's almost same as you're watching something on a blu ray so that's one of the good things and amazon and you can choose what you are watching right yes so netflix anyway is available in sri lanka so if you have a tv that has a ne- uh, netflix uh, app installed you can watch it if you have a phone you can install the app uh, or else uh, there's amazon is now kind of moving into international delivery so amazon has a video service as well so amazon bundle that with your prime account yeah so in amazon prime is something uh, it's a bundle product uh, where you pay a an annual fee which is about 99 dollars uh, you get free shipping if you're buying on amazon again keep in mind amazon doesn't ship to sri lanka only yeah. limited amount of product like cd's books they only sell but if you're in us some other country they do next day shipping for free and you get some uh plus apart from that you get discounts um then you get this video content delivered because amazon has already started de- developing their own content so yeah. apart from other content they already have it so you can watch that uh, but amazon uh, prime doesn't necessarily guarantee everything on amazon video you will get it for free but certain things you have to buy uh but uh, there's a new player in town iflix So yeah. that's a Malaysian company if I'm not mistaken that's also available and the price is about 500 rupees I think and they also have local content as well they also have local contents and uh, Hulu is no longer I mean like it's not directly available to Sri Lanka but Hulu works in a similar way that TV channels works because you get advertisements and you can't skip it you have mm-hmm. to watch it uh, again if you go with a paid service it's fine uh all these things use internet bandwidth content is same as watching youtube uh, but in better quality so if you can watch a youtube in hd without buffering without you know breaking that mean uh, you can watch netflix or uh, amazon prime videos everything amazon prime you can actually get it in sri lanka but only thing is you will only be able to stream certain amount of content so make sure that the content on netflix calling us this another cool thing also so uh, say you have a favorite tv show but uh, the thing is uh, once it's released you can watch all the episodes yeah so, so they normally release everything at once, at once yeah. so house of card for example that comes at once yeah so it can be done with it in about a month so what i normally do is i finish it in about a week uh again if you are i mean if, if, if the band is a concern mm-hmm. like you get the night time band uh for example this iflix allow you to do da- local downloads 
So iFlix is basically you can download it during the night and you can watch it during the daytime. Mm. So that allow you to store it locally. That's a good thing. I think uh, Netflix and Amazon still don't support this, but I'm, uh, I use iTunes as well. Now I don't. I mean, I used to use it. So iTunes, you can actually download it. You can download. You can copy to your phone. You can you know plug your computer computer into the TV and you can watch that. So you can buy seasons of it. If you are watching a particular TV series, if you like it, you can buy a season or an episode or the entire series. Uh, but again, it's not cheap. Uh, but the only plus is you can download it during the peak hours, during the night time, and then you can take it. Kalinga, do you have to have a smart TV to watch Netflix and other? No, I mean if you don't have a smart TV, you you have other choices, right? For example, if you don't want to buy a smart TV, but the price difference between a normal full HD TV and a smart TV is a big difference. Yeah. You can get like a third generation Apple TV, which is about thirteen thousand rupees. Or else uh, a Chromecast, which you can plug to your normal TV, right? Which you can plug to your normal TV. You can get a Amazon Fire TV stick. I mean, there are a lot of uh, people who brings them down. I think uh, Chromecast would be the easiest way of getting about it. And there are other Android TV jacks that you can plug into HDMI mm-hmm. port and use it. So if you use Chromecast, you have to play your movies uh, in your phone or any other. Yeah, and then you have to stream it. But yeah. in Chromecast, what actually happens is you only need the app to in play it. Right. Once you play it, it actually comes to the Chromecast itself, not to right. your phone. Uh, those are the easy way of getting around uh, to get your contents delivered. Um, that's all the time we have for this week. Uh, thank you so much for joining us. See you next week.